Hey everybody, I'm Emily and I'm going to lead us in our walking meditation today. If any of you guys, I'm sure you have gone to Buddhist retreat. I remember my first retreat I ever went to at Spirit Rock. It was five days and of course I had never done a day long. I just went whole hog for five days and I got there and they gave me the schedule and I just, my jaw dropped because from 5.30 to 9 at night, it was just sit for 30 minutes, walk for 30 minutes, sit for 30 minutes, walk for 30 minutes. And I didn't know how I was going to handle that, but I made it through. We all do. Um, and so the walking meditation is a really nice break from the sitting. So that's what we're going to do today. Um, there are quite a few ways to do walking meditation. And um, I'm going to guide us in just a really simple one, which is what I've been taught, which is basically you're gonna just pick um, a path in your house, in your hallway, outside, maybe 10 to 40 feet. And you're gonna walk back and forth on that same path. So when you get to the end, you're gonna turn around and come back. And the idea is it is a meditation. So you want to have an object of focus. And whenever your mind wanders, you're gonna come back to that object of focus. Um, my two recommendations, your choice, choose your own adventure for your object of focus could be the sensation of your breath. It's always a nice one. And so you're walking, but you're still having the awareness of your breath. The other one, which is the one I'm going to choose today, is the sensation of the process of walking. So how does it feel? I'm going to place my awareness in the sole of my foot when I place it down and in the lifting of my foot when I bring it up and then the placing of my foot, my other foot when I bring it down. So I would just recommend right now you choose what your object of focus is going to be and then like in all meditations our minds will wander we will go off into la la land and we will come back again and again to that object of focus i did want to share a sweet poem by Thich Nhat han on walking meditation which i like because it gives us this remembrance that walking meditation isn't about getting anywhere, it's about the journey itself. So here is his poem on walking meditation. Take my hand, we will walk, we will only walk. We will enjoy our walk without thinking of arriving anywhere. Walk peacefully, walk happily, our walk is a peace walk. Our walk is a happiness walk. Then we learn that there is no peace walk, that peace is the walk, that there is no happiness walk, that happiness is the walk. We walk for ourselves, we walk for everyone, always hand in hand. Walk and touch peace every moment, walk and touch happiness every moment. Each step brings a fresh breeze. Each step makes a flower bloom under our feet. Kiss the earth with your feet. Print on earth your love and happiness. Earth will be safe when we feel in us enough safety. So I can put that in the chat if people, oh, Scott's already on it, beautiful. Um, Oh, and one final thing about your hands. I'm going to just leave my hands at my side. I believe that for Zen, in the Zen tradition, you cup your left thumb inside your fist and you place your right hand on top and your right thumb goes in the crease on top of your left thumb and you place this above your navel. So if you, and correct me others if I'm wrong, 
So if you'd like to walk like that, feel free. I'm just gonna walk with my hands down. Did I miss anything, friends? Okay, so find your spot. I will time us for the remaining time, 10 minutes, and I'll ring the bell at the end. 